Yes. Yes. What's going on, everybody? This is Zero Gravity Training. I just finished monstrous volume, the workout that's called Contrast Gains. Uh, it was a combination of bell work, kettlebell, together with body weight, pull-ups, push-ups, plyo versions. Uh, it was enjoyable. It was very long because I chose it. I was three days off, was a little bit recovering my leg. It feels almost 95% at this point feels great so tomorrow or day after i will come up with nice cool leg workouts and we will be back again 100 percent as for today workout i want to tell you that it's 400 repetitions a monstrous volume but why it took so long because i was working with two of the 70 pounds in each hand 32 kg that could be adjustable let's say if i took 50 pounds in each hand the distance would be done quite faster same with 35 pounds but I choose to work with this weight, especially I was off for three days, so why shouldn't I? You know, I go all the way and that felt great. You also can do the half of that because the hybrids up to uh, the four, up to five actually, one to four are similar to the ones which are uh, five to eight. So it's up to you. You can repeat this pretty much same distance with a different uh, just adjustment on burpees or you can go halfway you know everything can be adjustable you can do regular push-ups instead of plyometric versions of push-ups you can choose the kettlebell weight that's lighter take a little less pause whatever you want it's all yours you know <laughs> so anyways glad to be back hope to see you soon zero gravity peace peace and have a great weekend of course all right everybody i'm back nice three-day rest feels good so now it's time to work and I decided to start pretty practical, nice intense distance for the beginning. <laughs> so anyways, so it's gonna be hybrid workout that will include all the major instrumental, fundamental kettlebell exercises blended with bodyweight exercises, which are also fundamental. Uh, the pull-ups, uh, plyo push-ups, burpees and stuff like that. So. Here's two of the 71 pound kettlebells, 32 kg each. So we're gonna try to crush that distance nice and smooth. So we're gonna go with no rush. We're gonna try to spread the intensity throughout the whole workout. And that's all it matters. Clean form, nice rhythm, everything throughout the whole workout. So the first <coughs> combination is the double kettlebell standing push press together with burpees each burpee each of four burpees is going to contain 10 pump close grip plyo push-ups so i'm going to split it smartly so i'm going to do 10 of standing double kettlebell press and then get into two of the 10 pump burpees we go one by one stay tuned follow the rhythm choose the kettlebell weight smartly all right, so 10 out of 20 standing push press. One. Five. One more. Ten. Boom. Bring it down nicely. All right. So, ten out of twenty done. Now we're going into two burpees. Two out of four. Each burpee is gonna have ten close grip plyo push-ups. All right. We start in five. Four, three, two, one, let's go. Down here, close grip, 10 plyo. Ten and a chaser. Nice, that's one. So you see, 
the goal is to accomplish all the 10 burpees in one shot so you have you can have a little smooth break in between plyo means you want to make sure that your hands are in the air let's go for another 10 10 and a changer. Nice. All right. So that was two out of four burpees. Great start. Great start. Now we're gonna bring the bells back and we go back to the standing push press. We have 10 more left. So no rush when I say smooth intensity. There's a lot of work that has to be done today. That's why if you will give all of your power on the first ones, what are you gonna do on the next sets, right? That's why I think smart, keep moving. <clears throat> We start in 10 seconds, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, all right, so uh, back to standing double kettlebell press, we have 10 more left, focus and let's go. One. Five. I did eight. Two more, two more left. Let's do it. Nineteen. Twenty. Nice. <clears throat> twenty out of twenty. Done. Good work. Now we go back to plyo push-ups. So we have 10 two-pump burpees left. Four burpees in total. We started with two. Now we have another two, 10 each. Five seconds, five, four, three, two, one, let's go. 10 pump. Nice, 10. Keep moving, keep moving. We have another one, 10 pump. Close grip plyo.
five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. 10 pump again. Nice, great. First hybrid done. <laughs> Catch your breath before we go to the next one. All right, guys. So don't rest too much. Make sure you're ready for the next one. So the next one is gonna be single kettlebell hybrid. It's gonna be swing switch alternating single kettlebell snatch in this case so i'm gonna go right away without bringing the kettlebell on a shoulder i'm gonna go up back switch back so five on each side uh together with 20 pull-ups so i'm gonna spread this 10 of the snatch and followed by 10 of the pull-ups nice and smooth make sure you recover well and you will crush this distance <clears throat> all right so we start in 10 seconds I'm not gonna count I'm gonna keep the brief going on make sure I recover well Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. Ten alternating snatch. Ten. Nice. I was looking on more of the snatch uh, technique and uh, I learned a lot. Keep learning constantly, you know, kettlebell game. It's wonderful. It was very nice. Catch your breath and here we go for nice 10 pull-ups just a classic pull-ups Let's go. Ten. One more. Nice. Ten. I feel a little bit heavier <laughs> those four days had a little messy diet but it's okay sometimes you need a break little break one step back two or three steps forward that's what happened to me
I'm just gonna catch my breath and good to go. So we have uh, 10 more left of a snatch and uh, together with pull-ups. All right, so snatch, same thing as I just showed you. Catch your breath. Nice and strong, alternating. Five on each side through the swing switch. Let's go. Ten. Yes. Good work. Good work. Catch your breath. <clears throat> oh, I love snatches. <clears throat> the best exercise. Medieval exercise. Recover, recover your breath. Then we go back to 10 pull-ups. Let's go nice and clean. Five, another five. No rush. The form is the priority. Let's go. Another five. One more. Nice. Boom. Done. Two disciplines out of eight. Done. So quite amount of work still left. Take a break. All right, guys. We're back here. So the next thing is we have to do the standing reverse roll so that means it's gonna be a roll except the grip is reversed the goal is the back the core work and in this case more of the biceps work which is gonna be pretty enjoyable this is complex workout full body except legs legs don't go tomorrow this thing feels much better so together with four burpees 10 pump each plyo same thing except it's gonna be a regular grip all right i'm uh, talking about the strategy so i'm gonna spread it the same way i did with the previous one it's gonna be 10 10 and 20 20 all right but let's go one by one so first one we go reverse roll 10 
nice and enjoyable compared to other ones, let me tell you. All right, so now get your breath just a little bit because we're gonna go for the plyo version. 10 seconds, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, let's go. 10, fly, fly. Boom, chase. Keep moving. That's what, that was one of the four burpees. Ten seconds. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Let's go another ten plyo. Boom. Ten chaser. Boom. Great work. Keep moving. Don't stop. Very good, enjoyable work. So now we are halfway there. We're gonna do pretty much the same. And the same means 10 more left on the raw and two burpees, 10 bump each on the plyo. Ten seconds. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. Ten raw. Good. Catch your breath. Now, as you already understood, two more burpees left. Two out of four. Ten pump each. Fly. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two, one, let's go, 10 pump. Chaser, back, keep moving, keep breathing. So we have one more 10 pump left. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Let's do it. 10 pump flyer. Good start, good start. All right, guys, catch your breath. Not turning off the camera. Gonna run to the bathroom. See you soon. Okay. 
right back so last thing in list here and this one it's gonna be the swing switch alternating kettlebell clean which is easy money after what we did and together with uh, 20 chin-ups I'm gonna split it the same way so it's gonna be 10 on the of the alternative alternating clean and 10 of the chin-ups all right nice cruise rhythm let's go Nice smooth start. Good work. So next one we're going to do 10 chin-ups. Nice, clean form. If you have to climb down, climb down, don't worry. This is the full body training. This is not work particularly focused on the chin-up strength. Four more. One more. Nice. Nice, good, smooth work. Catch your breath. Let's get back to the clean. So it's gonna be, again, 10 alternating clean. All right, catch your breath, let's go. Nice. Good work. Good work. Catch your breath. We have 10 more chin ups left.
right? Let's do it. Five. Five more. One more. Ha! Great. Great. So guys, I just want to tell you, so this was half of the workout, which is 200 repetitions. This could be perfectly a complete workout. So guys, you can just finish right now and that would be great. And that means you will, you still do a great work, but I'm going to go for a double amount of work for the final boss grand finale and for that I have 200 more lap reps waiting for me I don't search for easy way out I do what I can and for this one I'm recovered very well as I will see you for the part two take a deep breath Here is the part two of the workout. Pretty much everything is quite similar, except the changes on the burpees. So the five, the hybrid number five, is gonna be back to standing double kettlebell push press. And here we're gonna have, instead of four burpees, we're gonna have eight burpees. Instead of 10 pump plier, we're gonna have four, uh, five pump plier. So that will give us a little more rest in between going down in a push-up position and we can put more effort since we are tired already but we, when we want to keep going you know on a full speed ha huh, get your breath so we're gonna start with a double kettlebell standing push press no excuses if you have to so we're gonna try to get the 10 out of the way right away if you feel like the kettlebell weight is challenging you, challenging you going down. You can put it down, catch your breath, and get back again. All right? So this is 70 pounds each, ready to go. Rush it. Let's do it. One more. Ten. Bam. Yes. Right. See you. Ha. Nice. Good exhausting start. We got it. We got it. Catch your breath. Next one is gonna be. Four burpees. Five pump. Plyometric close grip push-ups each. All right? So here we can go pretty easy. You know where. Start in 10 seconds. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. Five ply. Chase it. Boom. That's one. Catch your breath. Remember, smooth intensity. We 
go back for number two. your breath. Three, two, one. Back for number three. Nice. That's three. Catch your breath. One more. Number four. Four out of eight. Let's go. Nice. Catch your breath. Recover. Now, halfway there on the standing push press. We have 10 more reps left here. Uh, maybe I'll, I'll see how the five goes. And uh, so after five, I decide if I'm gonna split it five and five, or I'm gonna push a little bit more than five. I doubt that I can do proper 10 here because it's not easy, like I choose the weight like that, but we're gonna keep fighting, okay? So, in three, two, one, let's go. Six, four more left. Keep working. You wanna have that weight or any other weight under control. If it's not under your control, you're putting yourself at risk. You know what I mean? Especially with this type of exercise. That's why perform each of the reps, attempts, with a strict control. That's what matters. Give myself 10 more seconds. I'm good to go for another finish for nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. Four. Yes, 20. <laughs> Catch your breath before we go to that next one. We have four more burpees. Five palm beach. Plyo close grip. It's a great combination. Focus, focus, focus. Right? We start. Five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. That's one. <clears throat> Keep moving. <clears throat> Five out of eight. Done. 
go for a six. Shoo. Shoo. Great. That's six. Two more left. Keep moving. Moving. Let's go for seven. Good. One more left. One more. Don't go too fast because you also don't want to sacrifice the amplitude. Full range motion. Let's go, last one. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Done. <laughs> we have three more hybrids left. Stay tuned. Take a break, catch your breath. All right, let's go. So next thing, again. So we're gonna do alternating single kettlebell snatch through the swing switch and together with just 20 basic pull-ups. I'm gonna split it 10 and 10 as the, the same way I did it at the beginning. So it's all good. <clears throat> Ready? Of course. Let's go. Catch your breath. Next one, just 10 pull-ups. Everything is cooked, exhausted, but we're gonna finish it. Let's go. Five. Catch your breath, finish five more. <laughs> Good morning. Two more. One more. Ah, nice. Arm 
carbs are <laughs> jello which is good <clears throat> the weather is great by the way sometimes the weather can be too humid Fifteen seconds, and we're back on the alternating single arm kettlebell snatch. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. Ten pull ups left here. This is monster distance. This is what I chose. Again, this workout can be perfectly adjustable. So don't worry about you can choose the very challenging weight. Or you can choose an easier weight. You're gonna you're gonna make it happen. Ten pull ups. Five more. Five more. Let's do it. Zero gravity. <laughs> I'm just gonna check the camera. Less than a minute break. Off to the next one. Now the piece of cake is left. We can't do it. We will do it. All right. So here we have same inverted reverse row, together with eight burpees, five pump each regular flyer pusher. 
Whew. Let's go, ten here. Catch your breath. Let's go. Hop. We're gonna do four of the burpees, five pound beach flyer. Let's go. Chase. Boom. That's one. Keep moving. Keep moving. Second one. That's two. Keep moving. Remember, smooth intensity. That's three. Last one here, four. You're gonna be halfway there. Remember, don't sacrifice the full range of motion. What I told you. Let's go for four. That's four, halfway there. Get your breath. We're back again to the reverse roll. Ten seconds. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. Twenty out of twenty, almost there, almost there. Catch your breath. We have four more. Five pump each. Play your push-ups. Let's go, number five. One. That's six, I mean. Sorry, five out of eight. Let's go for six. Two more left. Let's go for seven. Seven. Eight. 
and the last one here. Five, four, three, two, one, let's go. Yes. Whew. Yes. All right, guys. Grand finale. Not too difficult. Not too easy. Catch your breath. All right. So here in the last one, as I call it, grand finale. <laughs> The task is gonna be pretty simple. So it's gonna be, again, 20 alternating single kettlebell clean. So through the swing switch together with 20 chin ups, all right? So I'm gonna split it in 10 10. Shouldn't be a problem at all. Ready? We start in five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. Stretch your arms, catch your breath. So now 10 chin ups. I don't care if you want to do it five and five, so as long as you finish nice and clean. Five, catch your breath, it's all good. It's okay to split. Another five, let's go. One more. Yes. 10 out of 20, almost there, halfway there for the last one. Catch your breath. Ten seconds, back to clean, single arm clean. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, let's go.
set, set. Last thing in list left. Just 10 chin ups. <laughs> That's it. That's all, folks. 10 chin ups. Right. Let's finish it. Five. Catch your breath. Five more and that's it. <laughs> it's a lot of volume. Good after coming back. Perfect. Couldn't wish for more. Let's finish it already. Last one. Yes. Yes. So I'm, I assume more than an hour long marathon. But what can I say? I chose that weight on the kettlebells. So I chose to go through it. Everything can be adjustable. I didn't feel like going just 200 reps, especially after three days rest. So I went all the way. Let's say if I cut 50 pounds or even 35 pounds each, that would be a completely different story. That's why I'm saying you can do what you comfortable with or whatever is applicable to your level. As long as you do it, that's what matters. And of course, you're gonna keep the smooth intensity throughout the whole distance. So this type of strategy will definitely give you some good practical gains so that's why don't miss it all right i hope you have a great week ahead of you and this is the start of new split my leg feels good ready to be back peace